Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Dr. Boxer, talking to Building, man. Y'all know what time it is, man. The doctor's in the house. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Y'all know what it is. Back for another YouTube video. Banger. But we will talk about this WNBA. You know I've been big on the WNBA, man. Watching women's athletics, man. Shout out to our queens out there, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, our sisters out there. You know what I'm saying? Doing their thing. But uh, like, yesterday, I wanted to talk about, um, you know, I was watching the Suns versus the Fever, you know? Uh, the Connecticut Sun versus the Indiana Fever. Uh, you know, and, and, and the Connecticut Suns, they have the star, Alyssa Thomas, who will be on the Olympic team, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and Dewana Bonner out there doing her thing. They're actually, uh, you know, engaged, I believe. You know, they're, they're together. Aww, and, uh, you know, on the Indiana so Fever, of course, cute. you have the two former number one picks, you know, most famously being Caitlin Clark and then Aaliyah Boston. So they went at it, you know. DJ Nate Carrington went off, man. She dropped a season high 22 points. Damn. I'm sorry. To lead the Sun back in the win column because, you know, the Connecticut Sun did have, uh, they were undefeated. Um, um, and they suffered their one defeat, uh, I think last week. And, um, yeah, but they're back in the win column now, or this, this past weekend. And they're back in the win column, you know what I'm saying? Which is dope. You know, they're back on that winning train. And uh, yeah, man, they, they beat the, uh, Indiana Fever 89 to 72. Uh, which, which is a pretty substantial amount of points, you know what I'm saying? And Aaliyah Boston did lead her team with 14 points. Like I said, DJ Day Carrington not only led her team with 22 points, but she also dropped a season high at the guard position, but she went crazy. And <laughs> her and her and uh, Caitlin Clark on CC had a funny moment. Check it out right here. The defense to come down and collapse leads to open three opportunities. Clark nudged. <laughs> First ever game of the WNBA, forcing 10 turnovers. Right there, you see DJ Day Carrington. <laughs> <laughs> where she showed that, hey, she was flopping, man. You got to stop with that flop city. You know what I'm talking about, CC? So, yeah, man. So, uh, yeah, but uh, their only loss was against, you know, like we talk about Connecticut Sun. They only had one loss, and there's no shame in that because they lost to the New York Liberty, you know, led by the former MVP, Breonna Stewart. And it is funny because... You know, not only did they have the MVP Brianna Stewart right on their team, but they had the runner-up on Alyssa in Alyssa Thomas for the 2023 MVP. She's a runner-up, and she's on the Connecticut Sun. So it's kind of funny because. Also, you know, the New York Liberty have the second best record <laughs> at 11 and 2 now. So it was, it was two 1 and 2s going against each other. The number one team in the Connecticut Sun versus the number two team in New York Liberty going against the MVP of last year, uh, Brianna Stewart, with the runner up and Alyssa Thomas. So I thought that was kind of dope, you know what I'm saying? Both 1 and 2s from, from different aspects are battling out. So yeah, if you check the standings right now, if you check the standings right now, you know the Connecticut Sun are number one with the New York Liberty number two and Indiana Fever with uh, Caitlin Clark and Aaliyah Boston. You know, they're, they're second to last place. The only team that they're better than currently right now is the Washington Mystics, you know. But yeah, man, so shout out to the Connecticut Connecticut Sun. They back in their winning column. Big shout out to DJ Day Carrington for dropping that season high 22 points. And uh, yeah, she went crazy, man. And um, yeah, hopefully to see more. More for the WNBA. I think I'm going to start uh, a segment called WNBA Wednesdays. We'll see how it goes, man. I'm going to try to drop some news every Wednesday on WNBA. I know it's primarily a boxing channel, but you know we watch more than just one sport. You know what I'm saying? I love basketball. I love boxing. So I'll catch you on the flip side. Don't forget to like the video. And stay tuned for more WNBA coverage from your boy and, from, uh, and, and, and more analysis from your boy. And you know what I'm saying? More unbiased and fair and equal news. From your boy covering all the stars uh, across the sports, particularly in WNBA and boxing, man. So I appreciate y'all rocking, man. As always, remember, God, we can do anything without God. We're nothing. Y'all be easy. God bless. Piss. The doctor's out. From the hood to college, both worlds, they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold, we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets.